Hi YouTubers, it's Smoking SC77 again for the third video, third video today. Um, whether on the deck you might ask, well, I have our gas station cigar review. We you know, guys. Okay, <clears throat> now I did have my video on um, uh, part five in my series of the YouTube pipe community, and I did um, my um, cigar review. Now we're gonna do a gas station cigar review. Okay, so um, let me make sure this is recording. And yes, it is recording, so that's good. Okay, I already uh, tried to open the cigar because I don't want it to tear open and break. Because if you know, in the past, I have broken a couple cigarels in the past. So this is Dutch Masters Strawberry Cigarello. You can see it right here. Okay, it um, comes in a um, pink wrapper. And it says National Imported Wrapper. And some of you pointed out this to me also. This cigar is predominantly natural tobacco with non-tobacco ingredients added. So it's not 100% tobacco, it's not a premium hand-rolled cigar, obviously, so... And let's read the Surgeon General's warning to you. <clears throat> okay, or to you, rather the viewer. Um, Surgeon General's warning. Cigar smoking can cause cancers of the mouth and throat, even if you don't inhale. Wow, I shouldn't smoke. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Anyway, so let's open it up and smell it. Just make sure I don't break this cigar or a cigarello, whatever you want to call it. Okay. This is what it looks like. It just looks like a little um, tobacco blanta right here. Definitely smells like strawberry. Now, disclaimer. I have to give a disclaimer in this uh, video. Two disclaimers, actually. Number one, I do have a little bit of a cold right now. I have a little bit of allergies or cold, so my sinuses may not be that great because I have allergies right now, so um, because the season, because the pollen's coming up, you know, and the flowers are coming up, so I have allergies. Number two, disclaimer, I'm not smoking marijuana, I don't smoke marijuana, never smoked marijuana in my life, I have no desire to smoke marijuana. This is tobacco, just tobacco. I don't care how nasty tobacco taste is, it's tobacco. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, um, it looks like this, it's just a little tobacco blunt. Anyway, let's fire it up. I'll have a dry puff, actually. Sweet. Kind of like a sugary taste, like a lollipop taste. And it's going to be a little bit hard to get a lead in the wind. Um, I think I'll be able to get a lead in the wind, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Got lit? Oh, damn it. Damn it. I brush the, I brush the ash off my, um, on my, um, shirt. Damn it. So, damn it, damn it, damn it. Anyway, it's lit. Um, in any case, it's lit. Let's have it puff. Hmm. It's, um, I would say it's a good, um, medium body or so, um, you don't really taste the strawberry. Okay, um, let's see another puff. Hmm. Very mild, um, extremely mild actually. I just have to let my cat out. Okay, now that I'm back, um, I just had to let my cat out of the door. So, um, anyway, um, this cigar is pretty good. Eh, it's, um, it's, um, pretty mild, uh, kind of syrupy tasting. I wouldn't say it's, um, tastes like strawberries, I would say it more tastes like, um, candy almost, like a candy, like lollipop taste. It's a little bit bitter, honestly, so... Now, um, obviously I do have allergies, so I'm not sure if I'll be able to, I'll be able to pick up everything in this cigar, because or Cigarello, um, because, um... I do have allergies right now, because everything is sprouted right now, and, um, it's causing me to have allergies. So, um, anyway, let's take a couple more drags. Not bad, actually. It is a little bit bitter, the taste of the, the cigar or cigarello. 
for the last time, I call them cigars, okay? I really don't care. Um, I'm actually going to start doing that. Um, I know a lot of people say, those are cigar cigarellos do those are not cigars, you know. Calling them cigars is a bad thing, you know. But I'm just going to call them cigars, okay? So, yeah, it is, a, it is um, I would say, uh, a little bit of bitter taste. It doesn't taste like um, strawberries. It tastes more like... Um, Almost like bitter candy, like almost like a lollipop. That's the first thing that came to mind when I tasted it. Was um like a lollipop taste, as in a lollipop you lick in your mouth. So now I used to smoke these a long time ago, back when uh, they used to make um Dutch Masters um strawberry berry, strawberry berry cigars. And um, they used to um, they used to make them in the big size, you know, like the, like the big size, like this big. And um, I used to love them. They used to make Dutch Masters Strawberry Berry. They used to make Dutch Masters Grape. They used to make Dutch Masters Honey, and then they made uh, Palma. So I really can't find them anymore in the big size. I'm not sure what happened to them in the big size, but um. I wish they would come back because those were great cigars. They bring back a lot of memories from my, when I first started smoking, so, um, over five years ago. Or almost five, whatever, almost five years ago, so, yeah, almost five years ago. Yeah, you also, you also taste a lot of the tobacco. You taste a lot of the tobacco. T taste, um, very quick burn. I'm only probably five minutes into the video of actually smoking it, and the burn is very, very quick, so I'm, estimate, I'm estimating probably 10, 15 minutes on the burn, so not much. So these are pretty good, actually. Um, it's a little bit bitter, but uh, aside from that, it's just a sweet, um, candy-like taste. I would call it a, a candy sweetness, maybe a little bit of a, like a lollipop flavor, so... When you when you retrohale through your nose, you get um, a, a sweeter taste. So these aren't bad. You also do taste a lot of tobacco. The tobacco taste is honestly um, not that good. I can understand why some people don't like to call these cigars because um, the tobacco taste is honestly um, not that good. It's um kind of bitter, honestly. Um, very harsh the tobacco taste. Now, I'm not saying it doesn't, it's not, it's not terrible, it's not a terrible taste, but, um, it is bitter and kind of harsh the tobacco taste. So, not the most appealing thing in the world. Now, um, now, some people do inhale these. I'm, I'm not going to inhale personally, um, because I don't inhale tobacco products, uh, aside from hookah, so I'm not going to inhale this personally, um, but some people do inhale these. I just am afraid I'm going to cough my brains out if I inhale this, so I'm also kind of tired right now because I just woke up about an hour ago, so I'm not going to inhale this personally, but you, some people do inhale these, a little cigarellos. Yeah, as you get through the, the um, we're, we're at, the, we're at the, the halfway point or so, right here, um, it's not the most pleasant taste in the world, it's kind of hot tasting the tobacco smoke, it's um, kind of nasty, it's kind of irritating my lips a little bit, so not the most pleasant thing in the world, it, the sweetness has kind of gone away, it's been replaced with kind of like a bitter tobacco taste, so not the best thing. And when I say not the best thing, I mean just like not the best thing in the world. Not not horrible, but not good either. So if if you get with my drift. So anyway, hmm. yeah, I'm not even sure I can really smoke the rest of this because this is really getting nasty. There's no tower coming out through the um, end, but um, it's honestly kind of a nasty taste. So. Yuck. I'm at the, like, going to the last third of the cigar, um, 
or cigarillo and it's really getting really nasty and hot. Um, really, really gross and hot. Um, I'm not even sure I can finish this cigar, honestly, so... Now, some people comment that I do smoke a little fast with my cigarillos, or cigars, or blunts, tobacco blunts. I smoke them pretty much at a, a regular pace. Um, I think most people smoke them like this. I, I don't think I'm smoking terribly fast, but if some people have commented that I smoke a little fast in my videos with the gas station cigars, or cigarillos, so blunts, whatever I call them, um, little cigars, whatever, so... Yeah, this is not really that appealing, honestly, in the last, the last uh, half of the cigar, so... Yuck. Okay. Um, I'm putting this cigar, this cigar out. Now, uh, for the the tobacco taste, I would give a rate. We're going to the ratings now. I'm going to give the tobacco taste probably, um, probably a 3 out of 10, honestly. It's really nasty. Really, especially the last half of the cigar. Really, um, nasty, nasty tobacco taste. Really bitter, really harsh. Kind of irritates my tongue a little bit. So, with... Also, I'll give the, the strawberry taste probably, um, maybe, um, a 6 out of 10, because it was actually a nice, it, it was kind of nice, actually, um, it was, um, it was sweet, it was uh, kind of like a candy, like, lollipop taste, but aside from that, it, within the, within the, the, what I'm trying to say is, by the time you got to the ha the halfway point, the taste was gone, so, so 6 out of 10 for the, the strawberry taste. Overall rating for the cigar, I probably, or Cigarello, or Blood whatever you want to call it, I would probably give this cigar a 10. Maybe, um, a 4 out of 10, honestly. So, a 4 out of 10 for this cigar. Uh, way too fast burn. Um, very, very fast burn. Very bitter tobacco taste. Um, just not a good cigar in general. So, I really do miss the um, higher quality, um, you know, Dutch Masters that were um, the bigger cigar, like this big. So, or this big. Anyway, give me your thoughts, comment, or subscribe, personal, all if you want to, and peace out there, and bye.